to show you guys how to take a valve cover off. Um, pretty straightforward. This is an 07 and it has uh, six 10 millimeter head bolts that hold the, the uh, valve cover on. You gotta take these two hoses off the side. They're just vent tubes. Um, they're gonna be stiff. So I love this tool. It's just a hook that kind of breaks the seal loose. Um, snap on, wonderful tool. If you don't have it, you're just gonna have to fight and uh, try hard for a little bit, even with that tool. Well, of course, I'm holding the camera too, but there's that one. This one, for some reason, is stripped. You can see it, and it almost looks like there was salt sitting on this one, and it just rotted the head off. So this came in for a valve set a while ago, and I had to turn it away. Um, a, a kit like this, like a screw extractor kit, it's well worth the money um, to get that out. But uh, I sent the truck away anyway because I had to order new bolts, so I wouldn't put that bolt back in again. So we got some new bolts for the back. And uh, on this one, there's actually two pieces to this valve cover. You see the clip. Make sure the bottom half stays at the bottom. That's where these uh, um, uh, connectors go to, and uh, you should be able to pull it right off. Now, the earlier uh, generation, they had 15 millimeter bolts that went through towards the back. I don't think you can get the back one out, but if you take all the other ones out and lift up, twist it sideways and then come out on an angle, you can get, you can get that one off. You don't have to take any mounts or, or the uh, intake or anything like that off. Um, and then the earlier 12 valves before that just had single valve covers. So if you can't take those off, then uh, go back in the house and uh, yeah. Very simple, pull that valve cover off. We're gonna do a valve set on this one. Here we go. So to set the valves in the 5.9, they're all the same, whether it's a 12 valve or 24 valve. The 24 valve you have to do in between the rocker and the bottom of this little lifter cap, um, not in between the rocker and that lifter cap. The exhaust on this one is 26 thou. The intake is 10 thou cold. The exhaust is the bigger uh, rocker of the two. Now to set the valves, you have to turn the engine over so until you find top dead center. Um, there's a tool you can put in the bell housing to crank the flywheel over, but it's a pain going back and forth. So what I usually do is just take a little, take one of those 13 millimeter uh, um, bolts out, and then I can stick my my wrench on the uh, fan pulley, and uh, I can turn the engine over that way counterclockwise because I'm by myself. You can also use a buddy system if you don't have the tool or you don't have an inch and a half uh, wrench, and all you have is a screwdriver. You can pop the cap off the bottom of the bell housing and uh oh look i'm bleeding and use a screwdriver on the flywheel teeth to turn it over so keep a buddy down there uh, i've got my little cheat sheet here to uh keep an eye on which rocker i have to set when um the other corresponding one is rocking uh, but we'll put a link on the other video to show you exactly how to do that i just wanted to show you guys how to take the valve cover off on the 24 valves and where to set the valves on these and a the little trick for that so here we go, very simple, have fun. And uh, uh, your buddy is gonna be sleeping most of the time under the truck if he is turning it over. So um, don't pay him too much. Here we go. Hey, hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you love the channel, consider picking up a tape boss to make those projects go faster so you got more time to watch YouTube. And remember, if you're not filthy, you're not rich.